When our child pornography laws were written in the state of Florida, it didn't take into account the advances in technology, such as cell phones and computers. Right now, when a minor sends an inappropriate picture to another minor, it's actually a felony, and they have to register as a sex offender until they're 47 years old. To me, the punishment did not fit the crime. We were ruining children's lives over youthful indiscretions. This bill addressed just that. As stated, we are ruining children's lives in the state of Florida over youthful indiscretion. So this bill uh, simply, simply states that the first offense, instead of being a uh, felony and making a child register as a sex offender, uh, will be a non-criminal violation. It will be a certain amount of hours of community service, uh, as well as a small fine to let the child know it's wrong, but we're not going to label you as a sex offender for the rest of your life. The second offense will be a misdemeanor, which could be serious. Uh, you could do some detention time. And and then the third offense would ultimately be that felony. It's going to help uh, our parents, and it's going to help our students, and it's going to help all children ac across Florida uh, to set some guidelines to make sure that uh, the punishment and the crime fit together, and we have just laws in the state of Florida that uh, we're not being overbearing, and, and once again, uh, I know I keep harping on it, but truly ruining a child's life over an act that is, is uh, more immature. You know, sometimes children do childish things, sometimes children do criminal things. To me, uh, a first offense, uh, of, of this between a child uh, is definitely a childish thing, not a criminal thing. But I do want to be clear, uh, this bill in no way, shape, or form uh, will protect uh, adults or, or people who are uh, going after children, trying to, to truly be sexual predators. They should be still be uh, prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law, and in no way, shape, or form will help them. Again, this is simply a minor sending an inappropriate picture to another minor. You know, once the legislature was educated on the issue uh, and the problem, uh, not it, w it was it was quite easy. Uh, we have a very smart and intelligent legislature. Legislature, so Democrats and Republicans are working together. Uh, they they knew that this was unjust, and it passed overwhelmingly. Did not get one no vote in any committee or on the floor. So it passed both the House and the Senate, and uh, hopefully the governor will sign it. It's sitting on his desk. And the fact that we did pass it without any opposition should be. A, should be a clear sign to him that this is important and we need to get this bill signed. After the bill passed, I got quite a lot of feedback from our school districts in the state of Florida because uh, they would come across this issue all the time, but they had no way to report it. Uh, they, they didn't, many didn't feel appropriate because, again, they knew that these students, uh, many of them very good students, uh, would, would be labeled as a sexual predator and ruin their lives or, or chance to go to college, etc. So uh, th I learned that this was a bigger problem. Uh, than even I originally thought, and that the school districts now could appropriately discipline their children and uh, educate them on, on what's appropriate and, and that this is not a good thing rather than ruining their life.